Hello students, welcome to Shogra Officer classes. In this video, we will solve the question number 13 and question number 14 from the JNU-ASIS 2017 entrance examination paper which is the entrance examination for Masters in Economics with Specialization in World Economy. So coming to the question number 13, a perfectly competitive firm produces 100 units of output. It faces a total fixed cost of, of 5000, the fixed cost total fixed cost that is TFC is 5000 and the average variable cost the AVC at this output is 10 so the AVC is 10 average variable cost is 10 when production rises to 101 and Q is mentioned here as 100 quantity is 100 and it is also said that when the production rises to 101 the total cost curve total cost of production becomes 6070 so when Q becomes 101 then TC becomes 6070 as here it is already mentioned that total fixed cost is 5000 so fixed cost will not change whatever be the output is fixed cost will remain the same so we can say that the total variable cost will be 1070 because 6070 minus 5000 that is 1070 that will be the total variable cost cost when quantity is 101 so average variable cost will be 1070 divided by 101 this is average variable cost for the quantity 101 which is equals to 10.6 and also we can find the average fixed cost from here that is 5000 divided by 101 so this will be equals to 49.5 So average variable cost is 10.6 and average fixed cost is 49.5. So we can write that average total cost which is AC is the sum of average variable cost and average fixed cost. So this will be 10.6 plus 49.5 which is 60.1. So the average cost for 101 unit of production is 60.1. Now let me change the color first and when x was equals to 100 or quantity of production was equals to 100 the TVC was also TVC was let's look at the problem the TFC was 5000 then and TVC was as the variable cost was 10 per unit so TVC was 100 into 10 so TVC was 100 into 10 as the average variable cost was 10 per unit so TVC was 100 into 10 that is 1000 and TFC was 5000 so the total cost of production was TC was 6000 and the average cost of production was 6000 divided by 100 that was 60 and as you can see from here that when we are producing 100 unit our total cost was 6000 and when now we are producing 101 unit our total cost is 6070 so the marginal marginal cost so the marginal cost for the 101 unit will be 6070 minus 6000 which is equals to 70 so the marginal cost here is 70 and we have got that the average cost was 60 so here marginal cost is greater than the average cost so the MC is greater than the AC for these MC curve will lie above the 
एवरेज कॉस्ट कर्व सो द एम सी कर्व विल लाइ एव द एवरेज कॉस्ट कर्व दिस इज दिस विल बी द एम सी कर्व एंड दिस विल बी द एवरेज कॉस्ट कर्व सो ऑप्शन सी इज करेक्ट एम सी कर्व विल लाइ एव द ए सी कर्व एज यू कैन सी हियर ए सी इज सिक्सटी एंड एम सी इज सिक्स सेवेंटी सो एम सी इज ग्रेटर दैन द ए सी सो ऑप्शन सी इज करेक्ट फॉर क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टीन नाउ इट्स कमिंग टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी फोर्टीन क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टीन सेज दैट लाला लैंड इज अ पार्ट ऑफ अ करेंसी यूनियन ऑल ऑफ हुज मेम्बर्स हैव कॉमिटेड टू कॉमन करेंसी सो देर इज अ करेंसी यूनियन एंड सम ऑफ द कंट्रीज आर पार्टिसिपेटिंग इन द करेंसी यूनियन कैपिटल मूव्स फ्रीली अक्रॉस द बॉर्डर सो देर आर नो रेस्ट्रिक्शन बिटवीन मूविंग मूवमेंट ऑफ कैपिटल फ्रॉम वन कंट्री टू एनदर कंट्री सो लेट्स दिस इज कंट्री वन एंड दिस इज कंट्री टू सो कैपिटल कैन मूव फ्रीली फ्रॉम कंट्री वन टू कंट्री टू एज वेल एज फ्रॉम कंट्री टू टू कंट्री वन एज दे हैव फॉर्म्ड अ करेंसी यूनियन सो इन दिस सिचुएशन हुई वन विल हैपन सो लाला लैंड फिजिकल पॉलिसी विल हैव नो इफेक्ट लाला लैंड मॉनिटरी पॉलिसी विल हैव विल बी इन इफेक्टिव द मनी मल्टीप्लेयर इन लाला लैंड विल गो अप द एग्रीगेट सप्लाई कर्व विल बिकम हॉराइजेंटल एज यू नो दैट अकॉर्डिंग टू द मांडल फ्लेमिंग मॉडल द मांडल फ्लेमिंग मॉडल when you were forming a currency union and there were free movement of capital then your monetary policy will be ineffective so option b is correct so according to mandel fleming model if you are in a currency common currency union your monetary policy will be ineffective so the answer of 14 is option b this was all for this video so now if you have any queries or any doubts you can feel free to call us in this number 9836793076 or you can send us email at shourab sir classes dot com thank you stay tuned for more videos